Let's talk of the environmental degradation causes as to what are those factors which are responsible for the degradation of environment. The first factor is the population explosion. When the population starts increasing many folds, there is lot of pressure which falls on the environment. To feed these growing mouth, we have to have some kind of pressure on the environment leading to its degradation. The second is the widespread poverty. In a country like India, when so many people are living below the poverty line, when they do not have sufficient to eat, that is the time there will be environmental degradation. The people have to resort to measures which are not good for the environment in order to fulfill their basic needs. Then we have the urbanization. With the fast growing urbanization, that is people moving from the rural to the urban areas and the advancement in the urban areas, the building of infrastructure in the urban areas is leading to the degradation of the environment. Because we start exploiting the environment at the length, at the pace at which we should not. Next is the use of fertilizers and manures like the pesticides, the insecticides, the chemical fertilizers which are not at all good for the land and thus it leads to environmental degradation. Then we have the industrialization. Industrialization is both a boon and a bane. On one side it gives plenty to mankind and on the other side it is the biggest factor which leads to the noise pollution, to the water pollution, to the air pollution. So the biggest factor is industrialization. Then next is the vehicles. So many vehicles moving on the roads, transmitting so much of smoke is leading to environmental degradation. And then we have disregard of civic norms. In India, due to illiteracy, People do not follow the civic norms set for safeguarding environment. They pay no heed to these norms because they feel that it is not their responsibility. Their responsibility is just to sustain, to earn and to have a good standard of living for themselves and their families. They do not bother of the environment because they do not have the knowledge they are not literate in that sense. Well, as far as the state of environment is concerned in India, we will be shocked to hear that India has almost 15% of the world population, but only 2% of its area is under forest. So, which means a very alarming state as far as environment is concerned. And when I talk of the state of environment in India, it is very paradoxical also because now we are almost at the 10 most industrialized countries in the world, but we are also the ones who are having the worst kind of environmental degradation in the country. It could be due to illiteracy, due to poverty, due to population explosion, due to the kind of industries which are being set up, the fertilizers which we are using, but the state remains that India in spite of being industrially much ahead than so many nations is far behind as far as environment protect protection is concerned. So, this environmental degradation which is coming in India in spite of the development is very paradoxical in nature and we have to see that we start safeguarding our environment to its best.